Okay, so I'm supposed to give a countdown on stream. But, uh, oops. Let's need. Wait. One sec. Okay. Let me grab my controller. All right. Then um, I would say three, two, one, go. Okay. So hello, people of the uh, internet. This is uh, all events. Um, all events is not only the pain of my existence, but also this is the um, fuel of my nightmare. Mission thirteen. Why is that? Let us just say you have to wait wait for three um, certain items and have to hit all three of them in one hit. The problem is that the AI is kind of bad and aggressive, but that's like in every mission. Um, which means that they are very unpredictable. And when I got that first try, was like, mm. Okay. Uh, basically, mission 13 is the pain of my existence because I have like over 20,000 resets at that mission. And it's pretty bad and I um, really don't like it that I could burst out right now. But I mean, um, I'm glad I got it first try. Is that marathon luck? I don't know. But this is mission uh, 33. So Ganondorf sucks as a character, not only in um, competitive brawl, but also in single player brawl. That's not the quite right direction. I want to hit them to the other side. Oops. Um, basically, uh, VAI in this uh, mission is quite aggressive and uh, threats don't work. And no one ever dies except for now. And I don't know what Pit does, probably because he has the most perfect percentage number. Also die. Uh, okay. We basically just do the most bad missions at the beginning for everyone. <laughs> okay. So mission 31 is a um, mission where we, where both of the Ganons are basically stones and have a pretty dumb AI. But the only thing that hit that hits them like normally are um, the only thing that hits them like normally are items. But all of the other things are just completely um, like the knockback of all of the other things you do are just just completely neglected. That was badly pronounced. I basically do the side B squared because it somehow completely wounds the AI of um, both Ganon for some reason and they just don't use up B when they are um, in the air, which is pretty dumb and stuff. But this was pretty good. It was also a record on my new uh, save file. So that, that was a pretty good mission. Normally it pretty sucks, always. But this would have been a goal, but I don't use my timer. Okay, so this is uh, mission 17. For beginners, this is basically a... Um, it's also a pain of their existence. The problem with this mission is that if you get footstooled one time, you're basically dead. Um, if you teleport uh, wrong one time, you're dead. If you do something else wrong one time, you're dead. And yeah, glad I got it first try. Like I basically have my personally worst missions at the beginning, like all of them. But yeah, now we will do some better missions because we, because there are some uh, okay missions here. I think, maybe. Also, um, we have a thing in All Star called Web Characters. Well, like in easy mode and normal mode, like half of the uh, characters have a really broken web, and especially Ice Climbers are kind of cool because. There's the chance that um, both of them can just grab an enemy and throw them up and then all star in classic uh, so in an all star and in all events it quite affects the one a lot. We would also use it we would all uh, We would also use this grab strategy in uh, Oh I could I, hey that that's what I meant. We would also use it in uh, classic mode but 
yeah, classic mode, but the problem is that classic mode has a variety of fights where the grab strategy is good and you will just lose time. So we just use Ivysaur there or Metal Knight because they are both better. In all star there's just one type of fighting and sorry Ivysaur. That's what makes grab characters good there. Like, not perfect, but good. Also, classic mode has a boss at the end, and uh, using Ivy Sword to have Charizard at the end there, which is just the boss destroyer, saves just so much time, which, which is why grab characters are really bad for for classic easy mode. They're also just good in classic easy mode because the uh, difference between knockback on classic easy mode to normal is just really, really, really immense and and so big. Okay, so mission 22 is basically the most RNG heavy piece of garbage that exists in the entire world. So, um, you already noticed at mission 33 that characters can be stones. Well, now we have a mission where we can't manipulate the AI or something. No, we just have a mission where we need to rely on a different AI to just kill two enemies two times. So, basically kill them four times and we can basically do nothing except for damaging them and it sucks. If we get good items and something, yeah, that's pretty good, but mostly we don't. We can basically only do damage, but Donkey Kong could one hit all of them, but he doesn't ever. But I already had good luck, but because this mission can be quite long, I mean they could have also died earlier now, but I mean, I just hope they do finally. Like, I really can't affect this mission at all. It sucks. It's basically an auto scroller. Not that the stage is an auto scroller, but the stage. The literal mission structure is an auto scroller. Die. Thank you. But now we have. Where, where the thing is, uh, either we have a arena fight, a normal mission, an auto scroller, or a. Um, Pseudo auto scroller. Mission 22 for 23 and mission 24 are auto scrollers in their in different stages. Well, basically, uh, mission 23 is just an auto scroller because we wait for the escape port to appear. And I mean, it doesn't look like an auto scroller, but it's literally an auto scroller. Um, there's also a. Ah, I, I will talk about that later. But yeah, mission 30, mission 13 is basically the worst auto scroller. And also, I will now wait until the very end to open that gate because they can quite easily hit you out of the escape pod and you just lose the mission. Because if you aren't in the escape pod at the end, um, they will just kill you. Like the mission will be just dead, which means that um, yeah, it just fail and it sucks. So we, I just wait until the end to open that port because they won't do it either most of the time. Also this mission is an auto scroller. We hope that none of them will destroy the smash port but because we need it. And that was perfect. Blufekian! Also the pronunciation of the uh, um, melee announcer is still best. Still the best. Um, <coughs> Captain Vulcan! I love this voice. This is perfect. Okay, mission 25 is pretty simple. You... you do... You die. Okay, I never had that before, but sure. Also, preloading works here too. The missions will load faster. But yeah, you just do... Can you please not... You do this. Okay, that was weird. That never happened before. For 23, you can also save one second if you get good RNG. Yeah, true. Okay, so in mission 26, you basically want them to be at one ledge to uh, not back grab. To do this and this. Normally, they should die. Okay, they all die. Would have been faster if they would have just been killed, but sure. 
Okay. So mission 27, for the longest time we just had the grab strat. But uh, there's also another thing you can, can do. The problem is just that Bowser's AI is quite dumb and stuff. So we just hope for the best and hope they just die. That would be great, isn't it? wouldn't it? So we just do... No, not this, but it still killed someone. That's cool. We do this. Down C is quite broken for some reason. After, and if we hit Bowser on a certain angle, it just meteors him because he is often at that point of the stage. And never does anything correctly. Because from that point, it's really hard to just down C him to die. That's why we. I just want to meteor him. Please let me do something. Oh wow. He has also now the normal uh, physics of a small enemy. What the fuck was that? What? What? What's that? I, <laughs> what the, the... I stopped questioning stuff that happens in this category a long time ago. So yeah. So mission 28 is to just color some uh, leaves. Not all leaves, just some leaves. Just the leaves on the tree. A very weird mission. Yeah, Bowser is just... Bowser just felt dead sometimes. Come on, just die. Okay, we get, we get it, Ness. You are happy that your game is released in Europe and stuff, but... And not Lucas, uh, Lucas but come on. Just... Die all. No, I don't want to grab. Thank you. Okay, so um, mission thirty. Sorry, mission thirty is basically uh, as bad as the usage of Sonic and uh, New Game Plus. It's basically a wonder if any of his moves uh, connect. So we just use. Uh, his up A or this thing to just kill all of them easier. But it's um it's quite a pain always. Oh no 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 don't no no Okay I don't know what's happened there but sure. It's all events, like I said I don't question things. Also every like I said in New Game Plus every time when uh Sonic does uh, up A or up C, he just stabs. Oh right, I did that mission already. But yeah, Sonic is a bad character. He quite sucks. <laughs> okay. Okay, so... Falco doesn't have a good matchup against Mr. Game and Watch and that's why this mission sucks. I actually don't know if he has a bad matchup against Mr. Game Watch. I mean, who actually cares about the Brawl meter? Oh nice, the stopwatch worked against me. That's even more RNG that doesn't work in my favor and we already talk about all events. Oop. What? Sorry, I really can't play with Falco and this mission first. Uh, sorry. There's a loop that you could do in this mission where Mr. Game Watch just gets Mr. Game Watch uh, just dies in two hits, but um, he needs to be in a very certain position, and that basically never happens. So I don't even try to do it anymore. 
just hates me, okay? This man that has 40 jobs just that don't doesn't give a damn anymore. So sad. Alexa. <laughs> okay. Okay, time to actually go to some good missions again. Until we go to some bad missions. All events everywhere. Okay, no seriously. Okay, so this is like the second to last mission where we will use Ice Climbers. Because they are quite broken, but not like in every All-Star fight. Haha, <laughs> I grabbed them out, I grabbed her out of the teleport. Nice one. Hi Ice Climbers. Bye Ice Climbers. Yeah, it's really fun to watch, I know. <laughs> oh, a tricky one, aren't you? Aren't you? Oh, we could do it like that, but no, I actually want to end this. Just die. Thanks. Oh, come on. Is that a joke? It's not funny. Come on, Falco. Oh. Sometimes the grab is bad, but nah, we can take it. I mean, it's better than doing it with the old strats. They weren't quite good and fast. I mean, it was enough for 33. Okay, uh, so we just hope that they don't do anything. I mean, that's all. Okay, uh, she killed her herself. That was a new record. AI, everyone! <laughs> okay. Alright. So, in this mission, we basically just want to back grab everyone. Um. And we do that in <laughs> after we destroy the wall. Wolf is basically the only character, uh, only character that can make give us a bad time, but we live with it. Come on. Mm. Okay, Samus is weirdly active for some reason. Okay. That happens often, Wolf is always like that, so I so I will just hope that he will just... Like I don't know if he's too smart or if he's too dumb. I don't know. Okay, so um, mission 37 is a problem for a lot of runners because you basically have to hit all of... Hit, so hit both of those Yoshis um, before a uh, whirlwind appears. But you can't kill them because otherwise they respawn. So you have to kill them in the whirlwind. But that's often a problem because the AI can suck. Also they can just die before or the kill isn't count, counted and yeah. There can be a lot of problems. Die. Okay, neat. Oh boy, see mission 39. That's always the best one. <laughs> okay, so there's a loop. There's a loop that we could do with wolf to kill both of them instantly, but it's really hard and not worth it most of the time. That so that I will just try to do it to the stage normally. Side A, uh, side C is a pretty good move. Ah, I wanted to edge guard him. I basically just want to edge guard both of them. The loop is basically that we hit both of them with a few try, a few hits, and now he edge guarded me. What a pro. Die! Yeah, they're, they are a team. Oh, that's so sweet and stuff. But yeah, this uh, mission has a pretty high drop rate of um, 
shooting base items. That's why um, there are so many scopes and stuff. Okay. Okay. So mission 49 is basically the worst all stuff all the um, side of them all. Um, the eyes are all whack. Oh, if any of them goes into the um, downstage here, uh, you're basically f screwed forever. And yeah, you want them all above, but that that is already something you want with the older squares, and it never works. So yeah, if one of them goes down, you're screwed because they will never come up. That's why I destroyed the platform here, and the, the problem is it always comes up again. But that at least uh, some of them died before, it's, it's pretty good. But yeah, especially Tuning and Sonic and Wolf are a big problem. Always, also Snake mostly doesn't die on my end when I, just, when I do this. Die. Sonic. Please don't be like always, thank you. That's good. Now I just have to get a good wolf. <sighs> what are you even doing? Okay. I mean, it could have been worse. Sonic is mostly a one minute time loss always, but no, it happens. Okay, so for 40 and 40, 40, uh, sorry, 40 and 41, uh, we use uh, Ivysaur because, ah, sorry, um, initial reaction always when I see a picture of Ivysaur. I could do an Ivysaur pyramid, but I will probably be suspended or banned on this account, so, um, um, I won't do it. Okay, so Ivy Saw is a uh, both broken characters in single player categories that aren't subspace because the explosion radius of up smash just kills a lot. Unfortunately, the VAIs here are pretty aggressive, so you can have very bad luck. But normally, it would just kill them in a, all in a few hits. And that he has a rocket launcher is not good RNG at all. Yeah, this isn't currently lucky. They actually act smart for once. Boy, what a what a wild. But yeah, mission 39, 40 and 41 are usually missions where all events wanna really get frustrated on. Because of the aggressive AI. Can you please not do things you normally you don't do and just don't do anything? Of course the last frame still hit me. Like I've been shielding. Why do you do it? Okay, I wish that would have killed him. And... The air dodge oh wow he almost he almost acts like he would be a real player you aren't you cute aren't you a cute one okay so time for actual mission but yeah both three missions suck Okay. But yeah, this one is usually not the norm easier because they, because Giant Mario has such a big hitbox that up is way easier. Like here, that was a pretty nice roll, I need to say. Uh, the 
but yeah, it's just easy to hit all three of them. They all die in like two to three hits. Okay. That's a pretty, um, coronate, coronate corpse there. Coronated attack. Okay. But yeah, all events are pretty RNG heavy category, so don't wonder. Those things are usual. But, um, ah, crap it. But yeah, for every mission you use, uh, I saw in this rock, uh, is uh, Charizard also a good backup option because Rock Smash is just broken. Literally broken. Why do you think we use Ivysaur in classic mode? Well, well, because because I came and said your Ivysaur is actually kind of good, and they said no way, and I said no you. Thanks, Toko and Scorpio. Okay. So the last uh, hit of Downs is pretty broken, so even if I wouldn't do damage at all, Downs he just kills them. Like the last hit of Downs is just broken, which um, leads to pretty fast kills. Also, um, I hope you have time. 7.8 out of 10 too much so <laughs> that's true okay so here's mission two i um will just look through twitter and stuff because um this is the best auto scroller i mean it doesn't look like an auto scroller but can i lead your attention to um, um can i lead your attention to the timer on the upper right um yeah, we have to wait, wait. Mission 2 is literally, wait a minute, the mission. I mean, we had a lot of auto-scrollers and pseudo-auto-scrollers a lot um, here, but this is just wait a minute. The best mission 2 and through the auto scroller ever. Okay, but now time for actual missions. But but it's always a good way. Actually it's not. I would rather finish the one a minute earlier. <laughs> Yay, subspace squirts. Okay, so mission 4, we just have to um, destroy all of the platforms, uh, Vario doesn't care, we don't care about Vario at all, so um, yeah, I mean he's there and stuff and he probably will save the structure and stuff, but I mean, just kill all platforms. Uh, in mission, uh, like uh, Pokemon Train has the concept of um, elemental weaknesses, elemental weaknesses and stuff. So, if a character is like water-based, like Squirrel, uh, we will have more um, knockback and stuff against that character. If it's like plant-based, or like it will basically use the Weakness char chart of a Pokemon. If the character is fire based, though, uh, Ivysaur will not do much knockback and stuff. So we have to actually damage Charizard and stuff before we uh, kill Charizard. Also, we have to live with the AI. Also, die. Thank you. It's pretty basically good to just get Ivysaur here at the first. Uh, at first entering of the stage, but that's completely RNG if you get through a little uh, Charizard or Ivysaur. Okay, here we pick a uh, heart again because auto scrollers are faster, like on mission 17. But also the AI is bad. 
like on every other mission I want. Uh, so we, um, yeah, just live through it and wait, wait, and they kill themselves. What? What? What just happened? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Can, can can somebody rewind the video? Uh, how? What? What? How? How did I die? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Wait. Did a bomb spawn? Where I was? I, I have no idea. Like if somebody in the chat could explain to me what just happened, that would be cool. I, because I have no idea what the... <laughs> okay. What? Yeah, Taco, that's the exact reaction. I have no idea what happened there. And I'm not exact, exaggerate, exaggerating or something. I have really just no idea. Must get replay. Yeah, probably a bomb just spawned a direct frame where I was at that point and that just killed me or I don't know it. Up into the bomb that just spawned. Oh! As if... As if this category wouldn't even already have enough RNG. But this mission is neat. Okay, Uppy basically killed anyone. One, uh, one down B would be optimal, but two to three are okay. Oh no, Pikachu died. Yeah, but it's pretty ridiculous, like this category. Uh, what? Okay, mission nine. Uh, I would say get ready on time because we have like one, two, three, four. About eight missions left, but uh, it's all events, so we I don't know what will happen. What will, what will still happen? Die! Wait, who is it? Oh, hi, Andros. Hey, Toko Tomcat in this uh, chat is a Star Fox runner. I mean, I hope you will probably know who Andros is. I think that's some character from Mario Party. Oh wait, no! Uh, wait, there are, normally we need to use Pikachu here, but I mean I can also use Ivysaur. It's slower and stuff, but... I mean, look at the precious face that I... I... I'm in love, okay? It, this is a marathon one, it's not... Not the actual one, so who cares, actually? But yeah, Pikachu is optimal here, because you can just kill them out of the sky and stuff. Yeah, Ivy is actually pretty bad here, but I mean, who cares? You can't use Ice Climbers here because um, the stage is too big. That's why we also don't use them in stage 40 and 41. But yeah, actually... I really actually don't care for my time. Except for when the game actually hates me. That's not cool. Oh, oops. I still had this, that one. Oops. Okay. I mean, this mission can look pretty cool when you have the white ribbon down with uh, Pikachu, but... Who cares? They all just need to die. Yes, also that uh, pink fluffle ball. The pink fluffle ball from hell. You could also die. Thank you. Hi, Pikachu. Oops, I yeah, spoiled it. I can just throw rocks at your cute little face. Wait, what? But yeah, this mission would have been like one minute faster, but who cares? <laughs> okay. So this mission, your ice climbers again. And you need to hit uh, six Yoshis uh, in a certain... Uh, uh, how's it called? Uh, order to kill them. There's a possibility that Ice Climbers desync after a while, but 
and it would make everything a lot easier, but this is just the perfect rhythm. Like, this is what the last mission could have been if I picked uh, Pikachu, but eh, okay. But normally this mission sucks a lot. Okay, three for five missions more to go. Okay. Also, this is how Yoshi pays his taxes, so he doesn't. Okay, so mission 14 is a pretty good mission. Uh, it's very interactive and um, I'm gonna do a bad with y'all, okay? So, I say that this mission will end when on the upper right timer is a, is a uh, 40 second mark, okay? If I, if the, if, it, if the mission ends with 40 seconds at that timer, you all need to give me one million dollars, okay? I hope you all you hope you all agree with it. Good. Because I say you agree with it. If I'm correct, you need to all give me one million dollars. Oh, it ended on 40 seconds. Oh, oh, no, some people need to give me a lot of money. Ah. Ah. That's so sad. Alex, okay, no, I stop. Okay, so, uh, what was mission 18 again? Yeah, this is the last auto scroller. Oh, finally. Uh, yeah, but I'm sure, and I'm, I sure am, and yes, I might know who he is. Uh, yeah, right, I know, right, he's just one character from Mario Party. Also, that's not good. No, okay, I still got it, good. How did she do? I don't know. How did I know? Oh, how, I mean, okay, thanks for giving me one million dollars. Love ya. Okay, so Link the girl will just wait here. Okay, so get ready on time on stuff. This is the last mission, finally. Also, fun fact, if you would start at this mission and preload it, this mission would have like 0 0.3 seconds of, load, of a loading time. So, technically, this would be the fastest mission to preload, but the problem is... Um... um Uh, there are other missions where it would more like to start with. I mean, it doesn't matter that much, but I mean, you can take it into account or something, but it actually doesn't matter that much. The preloading time is like always 0 0.2, 0 0.3 to uh, 3 seconds, and it really doesn't matter. I mean, it would be better if you preload other missions still. Trust me. Also, I really didn't want that Cooper to die that fast. And you die. Oh, you kill yourself time. Oh my god, it's over. I'm happy. Okay, let's go on twitch.tv slash speedyfist and look what's up. Okay, a 3801. That was neat. Alright. Okay, then. So I need to give all of my shoutouts then, I guess. <laughs> I think. Okay. So I give shoutouts to the developers of this game for creating this mode. You're all great. I all like you. This mode is perfect. Nothing is wrong with it. Um. Um, don't add me. Okay, uh, so I give shoutouts to um, twitch.tv slash speedyfist for hosting my one, even though I, even though Mixer hosts it, uh, what? Um, I give shoutouts to um, the mods in the chat, you are the true heroes. Um, uh, yeah, then, like D Ducky said before, shoutouts to the Brawl community, you are, you are great. Um, yeah, I don't know. You if you want, if you want to run New Game Plus, um, there's a tutorial on my YouTube channel that 
pretty much explains all the strats. Um, what I, I forgot to say, say, I forgot to say that before. But yeah, uh, otherwise, can go my Twitch channel if you want to. It would be neat. Um,